Hello, this is Tim with Mocspeed Technologies Technical Support. In today's video walkthrough, I will show you how to load music to your Trio or Eclipse portable media player using Windows 7 and the copy and paste or drag and drop method. Once you have connected your media player to your computer, you should see an autoplay window. This window has several options as well as the disk name, in this case, removable disk K. This drive name will be different on each system. It is important to remember that this removable disk is the media player, and anything that you load to the removable disk is loaded to the media player. On your autoplay window, you will select Open Folder to View Files. You may need to scroll down to find it. This will open the drive. You can see that I already have some files loaded to the player, and I will show you how to load more. Now we need to locate the files on your computer. The easiest way to find all of your MP3 files is to use the search feature. Click on Start, then in the search box, put an asterisk, period, then the letters M, P, and the number 3. This will display some of your MP3 files and the general location of the files. To see the entire list, select See More Results. This window will display all of your MP3 audio files as well as the size of the files. To load the file to your player, right click a file and select copy. Then go back to removable disk, right click on the background and select paste. A copying window will appear showing the file is copying to the device and you'll see a copy of the file loaded to the player. The drag and drop method of loading files is very similar, although a bit simpler. Click the file that you want, but hold the mouse button down. When you move your mouse, you will see a copy of the file attached. Move over to the drive, and you will see that it says, Copy to Removable Disk. When you see this message, let go of the mouse button and the file will copy over. You can do this with as many files as you wish. When you are finished loading files, you can safely disconnect the player by closing the two windows and then clicking on the Safely Remove Hardware and Eject Media icon in your system tray. After clicking this, select the removable disk drive. A message will pop up stating that it's safe to remove the drive and you can simply unplug your player and listen to your music.